South Indian movie, night fighting, good action scene, and you're bugging me? What? The grandkids want to eat now? At this time? And you want me to cook for them on top? Oh my god. You know what? Whatever. You bring him over, I'll do what gotta be done, alright? In an hour, you say? Alright. Fine. In an hour. I'll see you then. Alright. Good. I worked the whole day, and now I gotta do all this. I gotta cook for them as if I've not looked after my kids. Now I gotta look after my grandkids. Whatever, let me go do my job. Damn it. I don't know what they want from me. I just can't get any damn thing working. Whoa. Bell, Big Boss, energy drink. Gotta try that. I need all the energy. Oh, yes! That's amazing! Energy, energy, energy! I can work all night long! I can cook all night long! Come on, grandkid! Bring it over! I'm ready for y'all! Hello, everyone, and welcome to another online episode of Cooking with Chef Harry. Today, I'm going to make an amazing, creamy, and easy mac and cheese with bacon. And I'm also going to make some baguette pizzas with some different toppings. I'm already charged up because I had some Bell Big Boss energy drink. Whoa, boy. Let's go do it. Ow. I got my oven on 230 degrees Celsius, preheated, only the top element. Now, four ingredients for a baguette pizza. I got seven slices of sliced, slightly toasted baguettes. And oregano. Basil leaves, about 200 grams of mozzarella cheese, pizza sauce, some sliced of pepperoni, and tomatoes. Now let's start assembling it. Take a slice of your baguette, put your pizza sauce on it, not too much, but make sure it's good enough. Done that? Let's start by putting some mozzarella cheese in all of them. Now on two of them, I'm going to put pepperoni. On the other two, of course, tomato slices. This three, I'm going to leave it just as it is. Sprinkle some uh, oregano. All right, now I'm going to put that in the oven. And let's go. Go to the top rack. Now, let that bake for nine minutes and it'll come out ah, beautiful. You know why? Because I got this oven from Melcom, where Ghana shops. Now, let's go do our creamy mac and cheese. My grandkids reckon they gotta make me work hard? Well, I got a surprise for them. This dish requires only eight ingredients, and it'll be ready in no time at all. Let's go do it. Four ingredients. We got a cup and a half of gnocchi pasta, which I have cooked al dente. A cup and a half of milk, half a cup of red cheddar cheese shredded, half a cup of white cheddar cheese shredded, about three strips of bacon, which I have grilled and cut up into little pieces, salt, a quarter cup of white all-purpose flour, some chopped up chives and four tablespoons of butter. Let's get cooking. Put your pan on low medium fire. Add in your butter and let that melt. Butter's all melted. Add in your flour and stir it. You do not want any lumps in this. This looks good. Put in your milk gradually, continuously stirring it. Now 
All right, see, no lumps at all. Rich, smooth, creamy. Let's add in our cheese now. Cheddar cheese, white cheddar cheese. Mix it till it completely melts. Beautiful, now sprinkle in some salt. Give it a stir. Add in your gnocchi pasta. Now let's coat that evenly. All right, it's all mixed up. Add in your bacon. Stir it gently. Yummy, yummy, oh my God. Beautiful. Put some chives on it. Awesome. Voila. Here it is. Now the pizza. Doesn't this look amazing? Now I'm going to have the last one that was meant for me, not for the grandkids. Mmm. Crunchy. Beautiful. Awesome. Love that. Having a bite before the grandkids get here. Mmm. I love that. Creamy. Cheesy. It's awesome. Perfectly cooked. Perfect. The grandkids are so going to love this. They're going to love me. Anyway, Paul, that's the end of this show. And I'll see you on another online episode of Cooking with Chef Harry. And in the meanwhile, you take care of yourself. Be healthy, be safe, be happy, and ciao.